Good morning, people. We are going to Gillies. <laughs> Not only me and Laura, also Elio. So we are here in Padang Bay, so going to the ticket office and uh, we'll get our tickets and uh, our departure is supposed to be at 9. Before we do it, we have to do the rapid test. Now your name is Gilly Air. This, this is the entrance. Rapid Corona test done. So now we are waiting for 10 minutes to get the results. It takes about one and a half hours to get to our island. There are three of them. It's like Gili Travangan, Gili Mano and Gili Air. So we're going to the one which is closer to Lombok. Ocean 5 Resort, so that's the place where it will be exam. So that will be tomorrow. So today we have a plan to eat and go a little bit around the island. And I think that's it for today. Everybody's checked in. So now, since we are really hungry, so then we're going to eat something. They said there is a good place, Ayam Bagus. So we're going there. Interesting fact about Gili Islands, there's no motorized transport. It's only bicycles and horses. So that's a, like a kind of specific thing about, about this place. What do you think we... Right or left? Or left? left. Let's go there. It's more like a pony than a horses. But that, that's the local transport here. Bicycles and horses. Looks incredible, right? Like, a lot of tourists. <laughs> like, are you hungry? Hungry, because we ate it, it was 5.30 in the morning. Now? What time is it? <laughs> what did you eat? In the morning, I mean. I ate chicken. Schnitzel. <laughs> yeah. Chicken schnitzel. And drink coffee. <laughs> okay. Enjoy. Thank you. I haven't gone in. That's actually what it looks ah, like. Ah, it's not the bite. It no, just looks like. Inside. <laughs> Everybody's full and lazy like a pythons. So going back to the hotel and I have an idea to go around the island. 
just to walk around it. Some little island hoping for going out. We're going to go around all the island. It may look like a cemetery, but it's actually advertisement for the local activities. says local food and that's how it looks like fresh hello good hello hello yeah You can see the sun rays, so that's why on this side there is a lot of swings. So you come out in the morning, sit in a swing, enjoy, and enjoy the sun rays. Good idea, right? The last time when the island was so empty was like the 1970s when it was like this hippie times when the first like the tourists started to come here it's completely empty island we met only few people and it was only local people no one else look at that all these bars and and restaurants and dive centers are just completely empty it doesn't feel that empty in Ahmed Ahmed is like a kind of busy place comparing to this one now and that one is Gili Mano even it looks so close it's always recommended to not swim between the islands because it's the currents here are really crazy, really strong. Don't even dare to swim here. <laughs> Otherwise it will be hello New Zealand. This this actually reminds me of some scary movies, you know, like a abandoned town. And then there is also this wind catches or this bells and this sound really like from the scary movie it's really like the like a team from the scary movie He's going to bite me now.
People, where are you? No one is here. No one. We did a full cycle around the island. And uh, yeah, here around the pier, there are some people, mostly locals. Then we saw some tourists in some places, but not so many. And uh, from one side, it's actually cool. Whenever, where, when else you can be on an island when there is not, there are not that many people. On the other side, it's kind of sad because it was. Yeah, so many, so many businesses collapsed, and I'm not sure how they're going to recover after all this. And no one really knows when this will be over. But. Thank you very much for watching us today. Uh, tomorrow we're gonna continue from uh, Gili Island. We'll try to find something interesting. And uh, I'm pretty sure we will find something. Um, don't forget to subscribe and like us. See you tomorrow again, bye.